Now we're drilling in some holes for the VGA heat sinks to come out the back end. Here it is. Using Arctic Silver Thermal Heat Adhesive, we're gonna stick on these VGA heat sinks onto the four memory chips on this side or video card memory chips on the side. Here's the GPU and the CPU. We cut off a section of the heat sink so that the copper heat sinks can fit right through. Luckily, the airflow blows right over all these heat sinks. Unfortunately, these heat sinks on the back are going to require drilling some holes in the frame and case. As shown here, a little drilling and dremeling later, you can get two holes out and then you can line them up, drill them through the Xbox case. Here we have the CPU heat sink. We're going to put thermal paste compound on the CPU. Yeah, a little really? pie with the... And it's in. And it's in. And in? Now that we've got the X-Clip back in, we can heat sink the other, or uh, put silver compound on the other chip, GPU, and glue it on. Here we've got it put back together and we're ready to bake it. Alright, so uh, about six minutes after we started baking it, the two lights went red on the left. So we're gonna take the towel off it and take the cover off, mm -hmm. plug in the fan and everything turn else, off. and we're ready to go. Yeah, turn it off. <laughs> Now in putting the Xbox back together, you want to put a little thread lock, just a tiny bit on the threads of each screw so that they don't come loose, just like that. Stick that right in there. These screws will never come loose by themselves again. 
hard drive, and she's ready to go. Ready, fire up. Or lights of HD. life. It's on HD. HD one. Xbox 360. Do you have a game in there? Oh yeah, well. GTA. <clears throat> it's quite the mod. Well, we're gonna do a uh, follow up follow up video to tell you guys on how long it lasts. Follow up video. Actually, it's like 11:23 right now. We gotta go to work tomorrow. <laughs> We could play for maybe seven minutes. I think it would have worked with anything. I think the overheating makes it work. Period. Yeah, the overheating makes it work, but, but we're we're adding extra to... cooling to all the chips and the silver compound makes it a lot better. It looks pretty hot, hot rod like that. <laughs> <laughs> Your battery is dying now. Let's show some 3D quickly. Skip all this. Go straight to the 3D. Here, I'll start recording the game. It is, right? It might be a big load. If this is the first time you've played... It's saying it's locked. It's connected, right? Wireless. <laughs> <laughs> the connector? Is it <laughs> no man, the controller, everything else works. The controller is not working. That'd be the most messed up thing. And that's it. We got the Xbox 360 working. Drilling in some holes for the VJ heat sinks to come on the back end. <laughs> People are gonna be like, how come Obama's helping you fix the next one? Take it easy! Take it easy! It's gonna be a good video. With you going, yes! <laughs> just laughing. <laughs> oh, I had that part for sure. I was just cracking up. <laughs> we should, we, I'm gonna go, have to add a bunch of music to it too, man. It gets super good. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like you, man. It looks kinda like you. That wasn't even bait, that was just a...